Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Oh, not my channel, our channel, <laughs> Ronnie and I. So today uh, I am going to make a pasta salad. So I don't eat pasta, Ronnie doesn't eat pasta. This is for a friend of mine. So in this bowl, I've already dumped some mayonnaise, a little bit of Redmond sea salt and black pepper and paprika. I'm going to add these. I chop them ahead of time. And right now, my pasta is sitting in the strainer, just finishing cooling off. So I brought it to a boil, boiled it until it was eh, not mushy, but soft. Before I use these eggs in the pasta, I will um, rinse them to make sure there's no shell. And I actually meant to specifically show how I shell these eggs. So these are free range eggs that I get from Costco. These are as fresh as I guess you could get from Costco. I tap this end, tap the other end, tap all around and then gently roll it. And this separates it and it pops right off. There we go. So I'm just gonna give these a quick rinse so that there's no shell in my pasta and there we go so I think I'll chuck the pasta in next and I just dumped um, mayonnaise you know what you want a little bit put a little bit a lot put a lot use miracle whip if you're watching your fat because you don't eat the mayonnaise you can simply use Greek yogurt and if I was using Greek yogurt I would definitely put some lots of spices in them with it. So I'm just lightly mixing that around. And what I am adding, so I have a whole diced tomato, uh, half an onion, some green pepper, and some celery. And you can add diced olives, you can add feta, you can, and honestly, anything you like, uh, just chuck it in. Okay, so for the eggs, just, and this was, there we go. So I prefer them to be that yellow, not overcooked. They sort of turn green, but whatever you like. Okay, now in the eggs. And when I finish this, I just have a look at it. Generally, everything that I make, I taste it when I think I'm finished. If it tastes good, you're done. If you need more pepper, more salt, I like lots of spices, like lots of flavor. I'm going to not add, you know, things like curry and oregano um, because it's for somebody else. It actually looks really nice. And that's why I add uh, the peppers and tomatoes because the color is nice. And if you're going to be eating it, it should be pretty. So I'll put this in a container and I'll probably sprinkle some pepper on the top and a little bit of paprika, uh, just because it will be pretty. So if you wanted to add protein to this, you could add some chickpeas, you could add diced up chicken. Uh, it's endless what you can do with it. You could change it into a Greek pasta salad. I just think of what's in a Greek salad, add it. Red onion adds a little bit of color. I only have my regular ones. I buy them at Costco and the bags are just too big to have all the variety on hand. So I usually alternate. There we go. That's it. Done. I'll throw it in a container and they can use this as a side. Uh, it would be wonderful for lunch if they take some protein. And then you know what? Some people just eat pasta. I would be starving if I only eat that. And I guess for me, it's just not on my, my food choice. So uh, that's it. Okay, bye. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. See ya.